What the hell is she getting at? Probably talk about the girl thing. Yeah, probably. Mm-hmm. Yeah, go on, take it. Mm. Say moose, why they call you moose? Hey, uh, big as a moose. Big as a moose. I can see it. Also, last name uh, sound like a moose. What's your last name? Mostakovich. Mostakovich? Da. Uh, it do sound like a moose. Da. Uh. Oh, I'm so ready. I've never tried this before. Uh, no, Spark, I'm just letting you know. They should, you know. Oh, she just getting right into it. Don't do too much, but it gonna fuck you up though. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. It's all right. Uh... Mm hmm. Spark, I'm... you just smoke it. Yeah. Then you sit down for a while and, you know, let it ease your mind. Okay, I am not supposed to be smoking this. Laps long and all that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? Why are you smoking there with the clips? Oh, well. Recovering from one. Uh huh. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. It'll do good. Pizza make you forget about that collapse. Alone. Opium mm -hmm. ain't never hurt nobody. Mm hmm. And that's the good shit, too. Straight from China. That's the man who fucking shot in town earlier. Who? The man that just walked down the street. In the plaid shirt and the blonde hair. Brown hat. That guy. That's the one I told you about. Mm, speaking of a trouble. Tibbet! I love you! Oh. I love you. Goddamn. I go steal her horse. I think she's lovely. Yeah, the law man. Hey there. Howdy. What are you doing? Adios. What are you See you at the back. I saw you run into the gun shop and I want to say hi, that's all. <laughs> oh. Can I come up there? Yeah, of course. No, no you may not. Well, I got Sprux permission, that's all I need. <laughs> also, smoke is bad for you. Smoke is good for you. Just saying. Smoke is good for you. It's, it's good for you. But, um. Yep. It is. I have no rebuttal for that. Do I know you, uh, blue lady? Miss? Uh, I think we've spoken maybe once or twice. What'd they call you? It's like two of my goddamn favorite people right here, and you've never met each other? Tibbet, this is Pearly Pearly Tibbet. How you doing, Tibbet? I'm pretty sure we met. Yeah, I remember yeah, you. Yeah, I'm sure we met before. Yeah, nice to meet you again. Mm-hmm. You all right? Oh, yeah. I'm feeling That's much good. more refreshed after taking a little bit of a break. Yeah, well, I don't know what a break is. I heard, I heard our mutual friends who fucked us up at Pronghorn, uh, got fucked up today at a funeral. Wait, I don't, what? I don't at a funeral? Mm -hmm. uh. I heard it was at a funeral. Who uh. the hell? Wait, who did it? I don't know. Why would somebody attack a funeral? That's what I said. I mean, exactly they're bad people, but holy shit, that's fucking terrible. Yeah, nah, yeah. I don't know if I like that. 
I had the guy take out the monster, they say. Mm. Mm. I mean, that's not really how you're supposed to do it. At least wait until the funeral's fucking over. Yeah. Why is there uh, What's happening? I don't know. Probably got spooked off of a poison. Probably no game. goddamn reason, truly. Mm -hmm. Anything else exciting has happened, or? Damn, it's great who wants to hold this pipe so I don't have to. Really? Give it here. Oh, I'm sorry you didn't like it, Ed. You got no, a tobacco I, I with like... it? But your puff puff pass? Is this out? No, 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 I don't. No, take, take the pipe back. <laughs> take it back. I don't want it. Wh why? Where did it hmm. go? Because you just oh. smoked everything that was in it, goddammit. Did you throw it? Uh. What it look like smoking on goddamn dingleberries and shit? I wonder if Lord could etch a pipe. What you mean? I don't I'm know sure you, if it's metal, you can be. it could probably be etched. Yeah, well, even wood, right? Like, wouldn't that be mm -hmm. customized pipes? I still think smoking's bad for you, but, you know, I'm not gonna tell you smoking's what to do. Smoking's not bad for you. I just am not used to it. Who give me something? Hmm? Wait, huh? this most Is this you? Ah. Is this you? Or ah. Sparks? No, it's him. It's him? Yeah. Ah. You're not a read, all right. No use of all right. those. Wait, no, no, no. I back away. Wait, what's happening? I have no idea. He tried to put hand in pocket, but the wrong pocket. Oh, bless you for that. Yeah, no thing. Apparently. What? Why? Uh. Do, why do you hate me? What do you mean, why do I hate you? Why do you hate me? I don't hate you. You hate you. There's some hatred there. No. What hatred? Hate what if, you talking about? Yeah, no. If Pearly hated you, he literally he would not be standing next to you on the porch. And I think he'd let you know, right? He'd be. There's honest. a little. There's there's a smidge of hatred. A smidge of hatred. What you talking about? There's a smidge of hatred. Let's not talking with your mouth, fool. First of all. <laughs> they they find like out a couple of things. Daddy. Uh, oh, what do you mean? Mm -hmm. I tell you. Can be told in front of them. I don't or... hate you. What gave you the idea? You well, the, uh, we'll be right back. Yeah, yeah. I was go, talking go about ahead, your big ahead, ass head. Ahead. What is what? What's up? He told me to talk a funeral. They say. Really? Da. Uh, earlier. You're a fucking uh, asshole. Uh, earlier. What, did... what? What? Well, I mean, why didn't you tell Sparks that? I tell her before. But no, there's much oh. more. After that, Peel Panther crew come through town, all gone out, trying to look for Kittleman. Really? Uh, also hear from Tar that he have uh, two source of people that uh, say Nayali tell the Lobo to scare people at the Pronghorn. Scare turned yeah. into a big gun <laughs> fight. Right, I heard about that rumor. Uh, yeah. Then, I talk with a lady named Chrissy, who's asking about the Lobo and hurting you and me. From, but I pay her to find out who hired her in the Misa match. Well, yeah, we, we f I, I asked this much about that during our meeting, Luce. You weren't there, though. Oh. Uh, somebody told me. Well, I out the forty dollar. Oh well, you just got ripped out of forty dollars, but. I thought I going to find out information from what other person might be looking for us. Right. Well, Miss Much, you know, she just wanted to find out about some information and hired someone to do it. I, I mean, she well, found out that fight. that person can't be trustworthy, which is good. At least it's well worth the money. Ah, uh, well, she think. She take a money and able and tell who ask. So what I mean? Hmm. Right. Not to know if a crazy is worth uh, trusting. Probably not. Uh. Well, 
wants to back up there right now. Hmm. That's all why, I know why right now. acting like she didn't know who attacked Del Lobo, so if you told her. Right now, I remember. Oh, Going to be uh, an opium. That's uh, what the uh, pearly say. He give her. Hey, bit. Yep. I catch T-Bit up on mostly everything, I think. Yeah, but I heard, I heard fucking, you know, that asshole attack him. I don't like people in my condition. Uh, uh, what? I, I guess I heard that Jack Kelman attacked El Lobos during the funeral. Oh, right, I, what? um, uh, Morgan were one of the ones at Pronghorn, no? Uh, so, I don't know, maybe? Why? Okay. He is part of the Bell Panthers. Was. I'm just trying to, because he just got a fucking hatchet thrown at him in the gun store. Really? I know he, yeah. he, he's been with the group. I don't know if he was there at the actual ranch. Cause I didn't, right. I, I don't know really, I don't know Morgan very well. So I don't even think I could recognize him. Damn. Yeah. Okay. I'm just well, trying to good. Fuck him. piece together. Yeah, no, fuck him. Why is he even, why isn't he wanted? Uh, I, I guess. I don't know. Not. I don't know. I mean, Sanctum didn't was standing right there looking at him. Didn't arrest him, so I guess not. Hmm. I guess I missed a lot. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Well, I mean, do we know? Do we know if um, Jack Kettleman, if whoever you know was with him, have yeah. gone to jail or? I don't know shit about that. No, I don't know who's still out there and who's not. Hmm. You know if Potter live yet for uh, Sisika? Uh, I don't know. Wait, what do you mean, boat leave for Sisika? We talked about that before. Santa Donia was going to be very busy because people go seasick. Well, how do you know that? I hear from Tor. Oh. Oh, okay. oh uh, yeah, um, uh. someone is, yeah, there's a, um, someone going uh, from San Denis to Sissica at some point. No, I, I, it must be done by now, though. They told us to watch out. Uh, uh, maybe. Uh, so maybe, they, Mike. They got someone, and they got, you know, I don't know who the fuck has been fucking killed. I don't know who the fuck has been uh, taken away. Uh, you know, it's just... Every now and then, a whole fucking group of people or law will ride through, and it's been pretty fucking chaos. Right. Moose, well, do you know who rode in with the Pale Panther into Rhodes? Did, did you recognize any of them from the shooting? Gray. Yeah. Who? Gray. Gray and. Peter uh, Gray or? No, July. Oh, July. Duh. Okay. Damn it, I wish I was here to fucking shoot him in the goddamn head. Shoot him in the head, and I'm going to the city, and uh, I'll awesome. see you later. Yeah, all right. Okay. All right. You see me later. Also, uh, one love boy, I wake. It's nice hanging out with you, though. Uh, yeah, it was, it was very, very, uh, very nice. Send a telegram real quick. Are you going by yourself? Get the chance while everyone like isn't being shot yeah, right now. Yeah. Hi, Pearly. One I love boy, you. Everybody, okay. You? I apparently I do right stink. now, yeah. Mm -hmm. Both of love to give. That is all I mm -hmm. ever I'll see you later. Do, you know, okay, be safe, please. Adios. Can we walk to telegrams? Because I have not checked them at all today. Yeah. Okay. Ten. Also, good call on that one. Ah. I don't know it that well. So I wouldn't say it. Pearly's fine. But... Do you see a horse on that wagon? Oh. I, I do Glad not. Glad I noticed it. Ow. Yeah. Okay, telegram. Ooh. I'm walking to Wallace. This way? Huh? This way? All the way to Wallace? No, it's right there. Ed. Ed, it's right there. I know to see horse on it. Oh, no. Yeah, there's no horse on it. Oh, no. I, I just walked to Wallace. It's fine. What? No. Uh, maybe we can rent you a horse from the stables. Rent me a horse? Yeah, yeah. I do that all the time. That's about 40 bucks. I don't have 40 bucks. I have $19. I right, thank okay. you. Really? Are you sure? All the way to Wallace? Not that far. It's okay. pretty far. Not that far for Moose and Abledney. <laughs> I appreciate you. 
Yeah, not that worry. makes me feel better. I know to talk a much, Brahmasa. No, no. Your name. I'm going. Yeah, yeah. I'm, no, you right. I'm... you telegram me if you live. What? Wait, what? You telegram me if you live, town. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought you said just live. You're saying if you live, like, I did for a life. <laughs> I'm just like, yeah, what? We won't leave town. Maybe do that or two. Okay, we'll do. Da. Can do. Be safe. Make sure to live. See you soon. Da. Bye, Ed. Bye-bye. Don't worry, I'll protect him. Da. Uh, you like it to stay on the path or not to mind to go off a path? I don't mind as long as we're just going to Wallace. Da. Uh, we cut across a heart of land. That works. Go through Valentine. Hope by Cumberland Fall to Wallace. Never been on train in a crossing. You've never been on a train? In a crossing. Ah. Oh. Been on a train in Chicago. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh. I mean, we have one that every Wednesday and Friday there are two trains. One at 2 p.m. and one at 7 p.m. Uh. And they're free. You could ride those. How many track have two? How many trains are on the track? Duh. Let me look at my list. There is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There are ten trains on the track. But the two different track cannot take a train from Saturday oh. all the way down to Desert, da? Yeah, no, you can't. There's, there's just two tricks. Ah. Some in the east and some in the west. Both of them have kind of like a figure eight loop. Figure eight. Ah. Yeah. Like uh, the infinity symbol. The fiat. Yeah. What does that mean? It means forever. It loops oh. forever. You could ride that track forever and you'd get it all those places. What if train conductor fall asleep? Keep train keep loop? Yep. Oh, not a good. Uh, yeah, it's not the best. It's happened before. <laughs> it happened before? Yes. And the no engineer one... fell asleep. And the no one can uh, jump onto train. I mean, you From can. You'd have to catch up to it. Very interesting. Yeah. But uh, we usually do not condone people jumping on the train. It's usually met with guns. Uh, but if an uh, engineer fall asleep, special circumstance, da? Huh? Yeah. Usually I'm the one jumping on the train. Oh. Glad you're not a hurt. I've been hurt many times on that train. Uh oh. It's a doom train? It depends on the day. Uh. Usually nobody's hurt. Just uh, scars. E. In the brain. Uh? In brain? No, no, no. I mean, I have, I've been butchered through my stomach. I've been shot multiple times. I've been stabbed, slashed, uh, gutted. I've been taken, kidnapped. I've, I've been hostage. I've gone through a lot. You're not a waste of time, Ed. Yeah. Need to always have a law on that train. Yeah, and we try. We try to get security now.
How much I pay? Ah. Uh, right now, not much. Uh, for certain jobs, like important jobs, you get 150. Need anything from Valentine before I go? I know I'm good. Uh. I got a bunch of stuff stored up at Wallace. You ever have a bear try to come indoor? Oh, many times. <laughs> In feet? Uh, I usually shoot it in the head. Oh, never wait to see. Yeah. They're usually very big. Wolf can come in through door. Oh, yeah. That has happened many times. And then they jump up on the counter and scream. Oh, they not be able to get up on the counter? No, they can't get on the counter. Oh, that's a good... But they'll sit there and bark at you. Till you do something about them. Uh. Who friend that I try to tackle you? Friend? Lady that uh, come running at you at the general store. Oh, that's it, Mama. Oh. She goes by Mama. She used to run the, uh, I don't know if she still does, but she used to run the saloon. The roads. Now oh. she's caused, she, she, she's bad news. Oh, you pretend to be friend, so she not hurt you. Pretty much, yes. Ah. Mama. What the worst thing that happened on a train for you? died. Got, oh. It was my very first train I ever did. I got shot through my gut because people weren't following directions. And uh, they had me hostage and they said, if you do anything, we'll shoot her. And somebody tried to do something. And then and they shot me. Stupid person. Yeah, well, now that person's a deputy. Oh, just before Rena started. Front the door or back the door? A back door. Ah. Right here. Thank you for bringing me up here. Ah. You'll be safe, please, da? I will try my best. Ah. Thank you. Add yours. I say adios. Oh, adios. Ah. Everyone all right? I think Ty Ryder is in the uh, general store right now. Uh. Uh, do you want me to do anything about that? No, I go talk. Okay. Daddy was always phoned on the switch there himself, and I learned quickly, corrected my behavior, and it stuck, I think. Hi, Moose. Anything I can get you? No, very good, uh, thank you. Hey, Moose, how are you doing? Good to see you, Ty. Hey, I take it then, uh, you probably had a conversation with Tibbet, yeah? I've talked to her, uh. Um, obviously you know we don't mean any harm, but I would love to talk to you, if that's alright with you. Uh, hey, where do I want yeah. to go? Uh, where, wherever you like to go. Somewhere, uh, somewhere private. Obviously, I don't want uh, people walking up to it, but, uh, like I said, I promise you, we ain't gonna do nothing. Uh, well, uh, if y'all like, uh, 
you could use the base store if you like. No, I don't want you want to hear this conversation. All right, Just fair go enough. Go up by the church. Yeah, church uh, sounds good. Is that okay with you, Moose? Uh, you want right. us to go with you, Moose? Oh, he's a fine. Man, Moose is a big boy. He can handle himself on that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know if you know me. I'm a little but, bit uh, focused here. I'm getting my coffee. I do not well lie. Not ever. If I tell him that he's not going to be harmed, he's not going to be harmed. All right. Uh, I like men of their word. Always have been. All righty, Moose, sir. After you, because you're so goddamn big, I don't want to have to walk by you. Uh, I hide you in the shadow. Need any food or water? I'm sorry, sir. Uh, I'm okay. Uh, okay. Uh, thank you for your uh, hospitality. I appreciate it. Yeah, you can see it. Right here's good, right? Yeah, right here's good. Uh, Anyone walks up on it, though, I, I like it to stop talking, see what they want, you know, and move on. I don't think uh, this conversation needs to be uh, heard by, by every single person, you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, understand. Uh, you want a cigarette right now, or are you good? Not a smoker. Okay. But I thank you. So, um... So I don't, I don't have to repeat a whole lot. What, what, what did Tibbet tell you? Tell you that, uh, or tell me that uh, they find you find them. Uh, they are a window rock. Take a weapon. Take them place to talk. Don't mm -hmm. hurt them. Tell them your side of story with whole Jody Queen a problem. Mhm. Mm da. Uh, What else? That we don't have a problem. Mm -mm. No. no. Oh my god, guys, hang on, Am hang I, on, hang on. This is crazy. I feel that everyone that was there just as guilty as Jody for pulling the trigger, I absolutely do. But I fully believed that every single one of you that were there did not have the full story. Uh, I believe that if you did have the full story, I think things would have been different, either for me or for Jody Quinn, and the fact that Jody Quinn may not have had your blessing, or uh, you wouldn't have been Thank there. you for you all the love. You guys are out of control. Over, over this and that and the other. Where did you all come from? And so, you know, I'm not going to waste your time going over all the details unless you want to know what my side of the story is. But if Tibbet told you my side of the story, then I don't need to go over that and bore you with that. That the whole story about uh, Jody mad that the brother get a rob. Go out to try to find you. Mm hmm. Robbed of a cattleman. Duh. Right, right. Eager wars start over smaller things. Uh, uh, say that one more time, I didn't quite hear you. Bigger wars uh, start over smaller things. Uh, like a I big mean, war happened pretty... right now. Oh, yeah, yeah. That, that, and I don't really understand where the start of it is. Um, I mean, I think I oh, know. Oh, you're I all coming to red I could be completely wrong, but we have no stake in the war. We don't want to be in the war. There's nothing in the war that, that they're going to help us out one That's bit. That's so awesome, guys. Get you the know, hell when, over when here. When I finally felt healthy enough to come back to the, you know, out here, but that war get was already shit. taking place, you know, and I don't, uh, I don't have my heart in it. You know, I, I've heard my God, you guys, what are you doing? You know, I talk to both sides, and there's nothing there to make me feel like I need to pick up a gun and help one side or the other. They can they can handle that, but we, we got our own things going on. Yeah. And I mean, war. You guys are out of control. Um, I told Tibbet that any time that we stole off of someone. 
if they reached out to us, or if they didn't know us, but they knew someone that did, and they reached out on their behalf, we have always handed back those items. Every time. Uh, you're all trying to break me! And I think the one thing that I want you to hear from Mike is that when we did go after Bianca, it had nothing to do with the last horse being shot or, you know, any of that. It had everything to do that Joey Quinn fully knew at the time that I wasn't going after Bianca. But you going to shoot me down for something I never did that I just thought about? Well, even after the fact, we weren't hunting her down. She fell into her lap. And in that moment, I felt like if I'm going to be paying such a heavy debt of thought that I never put into action, then I might as well do the damn deed. And I felt real bad for Bianca. Because if I wanted for Jody Quinn, that, that wouldn't happen. And, 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 you know, I can understand people thinking that's some sort of sick, twisted type of, type of justice. But there was no reason for me to get shot that day. Over a cattleman, no. Other than roping her up, but I think that that's very fair that that we did that. Given the circumstances and all the uh, other stuff, I, I, I wasn't just going to be like, oh, you hey. You guys are out of heck of control. What are you doing? Stuff. At the end of the day. Thank you so much. I'll harm. get to it in a minute. I promise. I think everyone felt like if I were going to do anything. Once we're wrapped up with this scene. Have. So that goes to my first point. I... And the Ryder family, we're very reasonable people. Very, very reasonable. But number two, is please, for the love of God, do not come after me or the gang. Because if you do, I'm going to tear down everything around you. I ain't going to go after you, Moose. I'm going to go after everything that you love. And... That's part of the reason why we went after Bianca, you know? The main thing, like I said, was because I got shot for not for Thank never you guys touching so much. that woman. Give me one not hot minute. Not doing anything. There were so many times Bianca came down to Armadillo by herself, and all of us, the entire Ryder gang, would be in town. Mm -hmm. We never took her. Never spent her. her. Mm -hmm. In fact, Celeste and her, uh, one day, we both to have a tea date sit there and drink some tea together. She got busy with something. We got busy with something that didn't happen. But we literally, like, never were going to go after her. But you come after me over a cattleman, and then I find out that your brother's in love with her, which, by the way, she betrayed them. I don't know how she betrayed them, but I think that makes it even more sick. That brother's in love with someone who, A, is married, and B, betrayed them. And he potentially put all your lives, you know, in jeopardy. I, I felt sorry for y'all. I, I pitied y'all because y'all just did not know the full story. Uh, you're going to keep coming out to a heart of land? Mm, I mean, we never only did the heart. <clears throat> that was just one of our spots. We had multiple spots. I have so much to go back to, guys. I'm going to need, like, five minutes with y'all. Uh. And I'll be honest with you, there's, uh, you know, there's other outlaw groups um, that thought that we that we robbed them of their people, and all the time they're like, hey, uh, over here, uh, this person got robbed, this, that, and the other, and it wasn't us. And I, I just don't lie, ever. I meant that when I told Jody Quinn that I never ever lie. So if you come up to me and you ask me, did I rob such and such? And I say no, I mean it. Uh. So so I mean um something I told Tibbet the other day is that you know when we're out doing our thing, it's sometimes hard to tell who you're riding up on. And if we ride up on you and your group and just you and your group we're, we're going to ride up, you know, some word might be said, and then we'll be like, oh, wait, it's y'all? Hey, have a good day. Don't be around here right now. We're doing some business, and then we're going to ride off and not do nothing. The only thing I want you to think about, is, let's say you are with, uh, you know, two other people that you don't know. We know it's you, 
and we go up and we're robbing everyone that's there, that means we're going to rob you too. But don't worry about that. Just reach out to us. Tip it hands or telegram. Just, just have her reach out to us. We'll give your stuff back, okay? But don't try to be macho man in that situation. Just know, right? Because if, if we would have robbed those two people but not robbed you, what do you think they're going to do? They're going to look at you and wonder, why did you not get robbed? They're going to put more suspicion on you. It's a lot better. And we've done that before to a lot of people. Uh. Show up to a group of people, rob every single person. Some people get their stuff back. Some other people don't get their stuff back. That's just how it works. Uh. Understand. But that's basically all I wanted to, to tell you and talk to you about. Um, Celeste, is there anything else you want to say? Not really, aside from the fact that just to push home that Ty's not a liar. If he had the capabilities of lying, he would have lied to Jody's face and none of this shit would have fucking happened. Uh. But he got shot for telling the truth of his thoughts, not his actions. Is there anything you want to talk about, Moose? Uh, I'm willing to answer any question that you have, potentially. Not I think so. I talk with Tibet earlier about the whole situation now. I thank you for not uh, holding a grudge against the family. Well, I don't want to sound uh, pompous or rude, but you're welcome. Uh, well, we, I think that could go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. Go ahead. That's uh, fine. We, uh, if you still go to the moonshine, we uh, still set up meeting with Dr. Crow. He used to for medical thing. Huh? Yeah, yeah. The only the only thing though is that he doesn't want that much. I mean, we can make moonshine and we do dibble and dabble in that, but quite frankly, he he takes so little. It, 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 I'm just so baffled why you guys just don't make it yourself. Ah, very true. Maybe if we need a lot, then we come to you. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. What the smallest amount do you do? Uh, the smallest amount? Uh, they're not really as... Uh, I get the answer to that question is 50. 50 bottles. 50? Okay. Just I so mean, they, I can they, go back to Crow and tell him. Time. Um, okay. Okay, I see what you mean. Um... Unless honestly, I want to borrow the data. Think... I think uh, I think what would make me feel better, you know, for taking the time to to make it, is ten bottles. If, if he orders ten at a time, I'm willing to do business. But if he's doing one or two at a time, it's just not worth my time and effort to do it. Ah, uh, understand. We try to make a bigger purchase. Da. Okay. So everyone happy, not inconvenience to anyone. Okay. And, and we're willing to, uh, whatever price he, he names, uh, we're, we're pretty much willing to, to go with that. I think, I think he's like, what, how much are we saying it is per, per bottle select? Do you remember what our deal was back in the day? I think six, six dollars, six fifty, I think maybe. Yeah, something like that. Not, not none of this ten dollars. I bought some moonshine at, at a bar. The guy was charged me ten dollars for it. We ain't gonna charge ten dollars for it. Good uh, I keep think a it's business. Ah, uh, keep all the business come to you. Very smart. Uh. So yeah, you talk to Crow. Uh, let him know that ten bottles is the minimum. Uh, normally we make batches of fifty, and uh, anywhere in between that, we are willing to fill his order. Um, anything lower than ten, we're not interested. Ah. Uh. In bottle for seventy dollar, huh? Now that's fair to me. Uh. Mm -hmm. I remember number to tell Crow. Okay, they still good. Like I said, Tibbet definitely has my telegram. 
Uh-huh. Y'all reach out whenever y'all reach out, you know, even if you think uh, we might have robbed y'all or whatever it is, just come talk to me, okay? Uh-huh. All righty. Moose, I hope you uh, stay well. We're going to ride out of this town. I don't want to be covered in red dust no more. You have a, uh, a good rest of your day. Duh. Have a good day. Take care, Moose. No, da da no, either you or yet, uh. Trying to shake your hand too. Duh. Oh, I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to be rude. Oh, I know. I'm not going to get that scary. Duh. Take care of yourself. Yeah, uh, you too. Both of you. You, you may be bad, yeah, but plan. sir, I, you don't scare me. If I try to scare you, mom. Yeah, there's not a lot in this world that does scare me. Uh. Losing this one, that's scary. Duh. Uh. All right, I'm going to head over to your telegram office. Have a good rest of your day, Moose. Yeah, uh, you too. God damn it. Why do they make humans that big? Okay. Da, uh, everything is fine. You sure? Da. Uh, All right. You come to check a telegram? Uh, coming to check you. Oh, thank you. Uh, I was hiding around the corner, watching. Ah. Uh. So they talk to TV before, then they want to talk to me. I think because, well, they make a threat, but they might be scared a little more on Musa than a TV. I think I got about 40% of that. Oh. They sneak in right next to you, sir. Howdy. Howdy. Um, oh, I so think Joe, I think they very nervous more for Musa than a Tibet, which is why they want to meet to me too. Right, Jody said that they want to fucking kill him, so uh, he's very nervous about them being around. Also, are they not in league with um, the Panthers and Del Lobos and that, or not? They tell Tibet the last time that well. The Lobo throw knife at me, get me in shoulder. They say from a writer. But when Tibet talk to them, writer say they never said to do that. Hmm. They say they say they fine with us, but they not to say anything about not protecting a Jody. Alright. Yeah. They say, we try to do anything, they not even come after us. They come after everyone around us. Yeah. Alright. They not make any mention of Jody, just about how whole things start. Want you to know, they not pay us off or anything, just... They want to, they want to hear, they want to tell us uh, their side of story. All right, well, uh, fine. It sounds like everyone's uh, worried right now, you know? I heard the Del Lobos shit their pants and started crying and asking everyone to leave them alone, you know? You think they're doing the same thing, the riders, like? Cause, uh, they're about to lose the war, like, it sounds like to me. Uh, they said to leave a family alone, and if not, they come after everyone. But that just sounds like... You know, little lion, scrape in front of you with claw, then run away. Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, as soon as, as long as you're all right, then, uh, yeah. you know. What, uh, okay. 
I was waiting for them to find me like they find a Tibet out yeah. in alone in open. Yeah, I don't trust them. So, who do know they're losing a war and want to come apologize after maybe they do tell the Lobo to throw a knife at me. Uh-huh, yeah. Cover us up both aside. Yeah. Wow, what a bunch of pussies. Uh, everyone about before Musa eventually. <laughs> <laughs> Not yeah. you, Tar. I put oh, you up on shoulder, is. parade you around the town. Alright. You okay? I take a look at his stitches. Is he fine? Yeah, he was starting to get an infection, but he's okay. Oh. So where Tabi go? Oh, I hear uh, they downstairs, aren't they? What? Maybe all the sands got stripped. should be a sand. Did someone take it? People they keep taking their sands. All the sands got stripped a bit ago. I hadn't seen okay, one again since. I'm getting a little... <sighs> I'm gonna step outside. Uh, That's a lot of people. Uh, did you want me to start the first steps of the coloring on this too? Mm, or... Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, sorry, what? You want me to start the first steps of the color? We can do this all tonight if you want. Uh, I don't really know what I want yet, to be honest. I, uh, do you trust me? I absolutely trust you. Okay. Good TV. Oh, what? Sorry, I'm kind of falling asleep. I, I want it to be, like, top. simple and elegant, not too flashy, you know? No. Uh, hmm. You know? I think I can give you something. Where TV to go? Way to blow my cover, Moose. <laughs> I come see your sit. I say, uh, what she do? Uh, I just didn't want to be inside the gun store. A lot of people. Too much uh, gun oil in the air, duh. Mm, yeah, that's for sure. Did you see where TB to go? Uh, I haven't seen her since I patched up McGregor. Oh. McGregor yeah. gets a shot? Uh, well, he's had an injury for a couple of days, and, uh, it's, uh, a little bit infected, so I treated it. Uh, so hopefully it doesn't progress into anything worse. I told him he better take care of it, or else I'm gonna have to get maggots to eat the infection. Oh. <laughs> Just as long as a maggot are not six feet under with him, da? Mm, yep, that's the, that's the call. Duh. You see where Tar went? He just here, might the... I know, he know. was just in the gun store. And I ran to the bank and then he was home. Maybe they... Maybe him and TB hide the together somewhere. Mmm, you think so? Only place I can think is a parlor house and maybe TB trying to play Jack Black. Jack Black? Ah, uh, hard game up there. Guy? Ah, that's what I say, Jack Black. Hmm, well we could look for him. Ah. Uh. New town, still look for same people. Mm-hmm. Duh. I feel like that's our role in life, Moose. Duh. We're always looking for other people. When we right here in front of each other. Oh. Duh. <laughs> that's sad. That does sound like a bad, a sad book. Yeah, that sounds like a sad book. Lot of, it? lot of kissy, lot of deathy. Duh. Uh. Ooh, that was very good. We both did this at the same time. Uh, wait to see. <laughs> oh, I love Faye. Faye is so awesome. Complete inspiration. You know the TV. I can paste that in here so you can see all the other people that are playing too. Because trust me, there are a lot better players than uh, that Armored Andy here. So, didn't want to interrupt the RP. You've been good, just busy as hell. I bet. I've been getting a little busy. I gotta, I gotta make more time for editing because I am still in August's footage for Buzz Buxton. Uh. 
You all right, Moose? Oh. <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard you get scared like that before. You appear out of nowhere. You spirit. You spirit. Oh. You were trying to play some Jack Black, huh? I don't know how to play, but oh, I look her away one sec, I come back and look, you right there. Were you just shocked by my immeasurable beauty? <laughs> Unquestionable beauty. Oh. Eternal make jealous, beauty. Don't, don't be saying that. <laughs> I not here to hear. Oh. But I no no I not a make a move no I make a move I rope you kidnap you take you somewhere nice then you oh. know I make a move. Okay, <laughs> well please don't kidnap me. No, only kidnap if uh, not like all right. Yeah, I guess so. Uh. <gasps> no, I looking and suddenly appear out of nowhere. You do. Mhm. Mm I sometimes do that to people. Oh. Yeah. It is snacky. Oh, Jesus. I think... These carriage drivers recently, I'll tell you what. Uh. Insane. Howdy. Howdy. All right, now we just have to find a green-shirted individual. And little lady with a blue hat. Let's she looked like she was in here. She looked like a newsy, no? Howdy, Dad. Don't right, drink the water. Ogleberry. Ogleberry. That's what I said. I'm Ruby. Nice to meet you. Me. Oh, likewise. Mm. A lot of people in I'll this take a look uh, Always, yes, always. Pardon me. Sorry oh. about that. Yep. Hey, Blood, you seen Tar and Sparks? Yeah, there, uh, there was a headache incident, so I think everyone's oh, kind of nursing it off. Whoa. Okay, I see what you mean. Hmm. I thought I saw something uh, crawling around under the porch, but it just turned out to be, you know, bugs. But you know, bugs do check. tend to crawl around. Yeah, that's fair. I thought it was uh, uh, something larger and inappropriate for a, a porch uh, in a town such as this, but it was just a uh, group. Larger of bugs. and inappropriate? Like and what? A moose. Howdy. Like a little bit uh, of links. Give them an right. Oh, okay. Uh, I have different, different envisionment. I have not, no. Yeah. Oh. I don't know where she go. A naked homeless person. All right. Uh, oh, aren't you a handsome son mm. of a bitch? Uh, go you? Tar sparks. Uh, the, um, but the name? Sparks. Oh, be a Penelope. Right. Penelope. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. What's yeah, that well, mean? Nice to meet you. My name is Moose. Uh, Moose. Uh, I didn't see you. I have a gun store before. Uh, in a while, actually. You know the, uh, the gunsmith in here? Ah, uh, for Lord. Uh, I think uh, it was okay. right after Let's go to I know. went to that is real name. Uh, we, he was okay. in the gun store, but he's not. Only yeah. name I know him by. Fox. Okay. That's good to know. Oh, right. Well, thank you, yeah. Mr. Most. Right. Appreciate you. Da, Buddha, look. Well, I'm going to follow you around. I'm going to follow me, Gregor, around. <laughs> All right, there we go. Now we've got an entourage. They probably went to the telegram office, they bet. Oh, they're Tabby. They see T beat. Oh, perfect. At least we found one of them. Yeah. I feel like this is half my life when I'm not on duty, it's just looking for people. I know, it's so exhausting. I just like to go fishing or hunting or something. You know? Oh, that's definitely not Michael. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, that is Michael! I mean, uh, that was a win. Howdy. Hi, Michael. What, you're a tar. Tar. Howdy. A horse out here. Howdy. Getting better. Um. Off duty. Off duty. Are we chanting? 
Off duty, off duty. Off duty, uh, off duty. Hold on. <laughs> I go find TV. I'm sure he can tell you himself. Find you both. <laughs> We've been looking for Thor and a TV. Oh. Now I find the both, I get the prize. Uh huh. Um. at the telegram office. Okay, I'll go over there and you can tell her about your friend Ty. Da. Wait, what? Da. Later go all back here. I mean, I'm not surprised, but I'm surprised if... Where'd you meet him? Graveyard, he brought up George here. Wait, he went all the way here? Da. Vita Salasta. Only threat he make is if we continue to go after. I mean, that we have hunt. no plans. Yeah, uh, well, we have no plan. We have no plans. So we have no reason to. So uh, he's just making. <laughs> it seems like he just repeated himself, which I told him that's that's what you plan to do. I will, I'll be in, you know, tell him you everything. Think Did he, he tell might. You no, he make no mention of going after Jody, but the Tar do. Tar think that Ryder's going to go after Jody. And try I to think... kill him. I I really doubt they're gonna try to kill him. I think that if they see him, they might go after him, but I don't think they're gonna go actively. Taramo, welcome yeah, to the armory. Howdy. Like You're them, amazing. So they've got better things to do. Duh. But I don't know him well enough. Duh. Celeste there too. But we end on a good note. I also That's... tell them that grateful that they forgive us. Because we don't know the whole story. But he also say if we try to go after them, they hunt uh, everyone around us. Okay. Da. I mean, unless we have something to fight about in the future, I'm not really worried about that. Built more like animal pushed in back of cage. Da? Last like final threats. I mean, if he's threatening us, it means he fears us to some extent, and so... We catch him twice already. Yeah, but that was with the help of people that, you know, it was just me and you, Moose. Da. Uh. We were there just to make sure that, you know, if there was violence, we were there to protect Jody. That's it. We weren't uh. there to actually do any harm to him. Da. Uh. Also say, if we're riding with people we not to know... And they find us, they will rob us too, but to just yeah. the telegram, we get the things back. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you told me the same thing. I'll let the others know as well. Da. Also talk about the moonshine set up again for Crow. But Ty not like just buying a 1 to 2 bottle. Want 10 bottle minimum, but a 10 bottle for $70, which not a bad. Uh, are they going to provide us some moonshine or... Da, we give them Were seventy dollar. They... they give us, well, for crow to clean tools. Right. So they're actually interested in continuing that business. I bring that up. Da. But but they're interested. They said yes. Da. Oh, interesting. They still all, do. all right. All right. Well, that means I, I I'm gonna take that as a way to say that we're probably in at least neutral terms now. Da. I think within the next week we make uh Trade with them. All right, that's good. I wouldn't mind getting to kind of know them a little more now that I feel bad that you know, fucking, we were told the whole story. Duh. Even if we were, I, I, I still probably would have went with him to be honest, but Duh. it's principle, you know. They say they still go after Bianca to get to Jody. They said they're gonna be... go after Bianca. No, that they went after her to get oh. to Jody. Not because of Bianca shoot a horse. Well, yeah. Duh. All right, well, I'm glad that you had a pretty civil conversation. I thought they were going to try to ride up on you. Me too. I was uh, thinking about that. When I take Ed to a train station. Right. All right, well, anything else happen? No. All right. Um, the only information I came back with is that I think I'm pretty sure that whatever slaughter cattlemen did on the De Lobos, it wasn't actually at the funeral. I think it was either before or after, but it wasn't uh. actually actively in the middle of the funeral. 
Oh. I did try to go down uh, near Blackwater and see anybody, if anybody knew of any like deaths that might have happened, but there wasn't really anybody around. Uh, thank you for telegram, by the way, telling me you go there after I, I ask you Sparks, telegram. I told, I told, no, uh, Sparks should have told you. Oh, I thought to see Sparks since I get the back. Yeah, she might have left before that, but she said that she would tell you where I went, and, I, and that was Emerald Ranch. Uh. So Jack Kittleman have little bit of class after all. I wouldn't say he has any class at all. He wait till before or after funeral to attack. Well, still pretty classy, you know, attacking some uh, a family that's grieving. Uh. You know, I don't know what it is about him. I think it's principle with him, but if those are his fucking principles, he's really fucked up in the head. Sad the part is he have people ready to follow him. That will follow same yeah. principle. Well, you know, something I, I, I bumped into Marley, who showed me where some goose eggs were. And I told her uh, kind of about the Kettleman situation. And I said, the only thing that, you know, we have that he doesn't is he may very well, you know, have many guns. Right? Who might Duh. fight us uh, b beside him. But none of them are probably willing to die for him. Duh. Oh my gosh. Duh. And they not have a Baba Yaga. Yeah. Or a Musa. We have, you know, a love for each other while friends don't have that same bond and, and desire to protect each other. I know uh. he has some close friends, I, I do, but kind of, the people that he says he is allied with or whatever, I, you know, we already got told by Solomon, for instance, that he's not even fucking going to be bothered to, to go after us or anything for that. Duh. People were worried earlier about all people going into Santo Doni after Jack Kittleman shoot up a funeral because that mean that right in the Kota territory. Right. Well, I'm gonna go home and I think rest my head. Uh, what about you? They'd have a little longer to... Oh, not with lightning strike like that. Alright, well, I'm gonna move the boxes. Actually, no, we'll move the boxes tomorrow a little bit. That way they don't kind of break down. Uh, every day I'm home, I will move up my box in the, my house. Uh. Alright, we just gotta remember to mainly move the, the chicken coop. Uh. Alright, well, you have a good night, Lisa. So I'm glad the situation with the rider was okay. Uh, I want to ride you home. I don't need a. Not the saying if, what if they're bad the people, six are bad the people, not I want you to be alone. Damn late does that. Uh. Not the saying you won't be able to get home on own. Want to protect you. Just I want to protect you. I'm pretty vigilant. I, I, I almost. I mean, I would have outrun the Del Lobos if they weren't right behind you. I understand. If you want to ride alone, I stay here. I'll be. I'll be fine, Moose. There's nobody around. Uh, okay. uh, it looks like the Del Lobos and Jack Kettleman and probably some of his crew are all in jail. I I, I doubt they're out there hunting anybody. Uh, okay. Uh, I just want to make a quick haste over there, that's why. Uh, use a storm as a cover. Exactly, that's kind of what I was thinking actually. I'm glad we think the same thing. Papa teach you well. Good night, Moose. Good night. Uh. Very convenient where I park a horsey for you. Adios. Ah. 
Howdy. Hey, howdy. Is Borka still here? Who's there? Borg. Uh, one more time for I'm very tired, Moose. I'm sorry. Who? Oh, Sporka. Spar Sparks? Duh. She, I think she's at the general store. Duh. Have to go see how many bueno. pizza cobbler Tibet eat while well I gone. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, she might have some more, although I think the, the, the box was locked. Ah, good. Borka. You Ooh. see Spork? I'm looking for her. Well, I, I can't even find her. Maybe Telegram? Okay, I'm going back to the telegram office. Look at Who behind the side of Undertaker there? Uh, someone else? What? Oh. Well, that could be her. Coop! Yep, yeah, oh, that's her. It's Michael. Duh. That is like a hawk. Or they mm -hmm. like a moose. Moose hawk. That Duh. thing. Sir, really? You could have gone around either of us, but you had to go right between, huh? Check your wallets there. Come Nothing on. can come between you and me, McGregor. We await the here. I love you too. Have a fun time. Is he alright? Yeah, he's going away for a couple of days. Is he going with Bianca? Uh, no, I don't know. Who the hell is that muscle man over there? Moose? No, no, not, not Moose. The other one without a shirt on. Oh, uh, sleeveless man. I don't know. He's been around all day. He, he was trying me, to ask. He asked me what... by name. Mm -hmm. Oh. Where is she going? Uh, no, him. I got really busy. Uh... Mm -hmm. After what McGregor gave me, four hundred eight dollars. Is everyone just coming in the back door now? Uh huh. Uh huh. Hello. No sign over. That's a exit oh, only. Mm -hmm. Someone took it. Someone mm -hmm. took it there. Mm -hmm. Uh. Okay. Sorry. What did you see? Uh, four hundred eighty dollars. Yeah. How much did McGregor give you? Uh, six fifty. Oh, you fucking asshole! Oh wow, that was well <laughs> done. Oh fuck. Gotcha. Uh. Yep. Well, I, I gotta get you can pay it whenever. Yeah. You can pay it whenever. I know you're good for it. He okay. know where you work. <laughs> she knows where I work, too. <laughs> uh, Are you an employee, sir? For me, but oh, right here. Girl, uh, <laughs> you need to get something for you, boss man. Sweep the floor. Uh, oh, fuck. I lift that gun on break. cabinet. Oh, shit. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> As you know, it is the law on the cross and that every employee gets a 10 minute break every 14 days. So I am taking that. <laughs> it almost feels counterproductive in a way. <laughs> Once was like, no work gets work done on that system. Okay. Mm. Uh, 10 minute break every 14 days? Yeah, it's too no much. No work is done. I'm a slave driver, can I say. You are. Mm -hmm. All right. Want me to walk you to bed there? Yes. Yeah, yes, okay, please. No, no, no. You're later, Sugar Bear. Hi. Oh, Sugar Bear. Sugar Bear. Ha 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 ha. Then the end of a lead crossing. Musa now, Sugar Bear. Oh my God! Mm -hmm. Leave me alone for five fucking minutes so I can go to bed. Oh, that man just got yelled at. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Look at how sad he is now. Very sad to walk. Mhm. Mm Fellow. Oh, hug him, sugar bear. No, oh. I'm not gonna hug him. Where'd he uh, go? Uh, he's, he's talking Rubian. Fuck. I don't 
like standing here with this much money. Makes me uncomfortable. You're standing right next I to take the money. moose. Hmm? And he can, he can hold it for you. Uh. Yeah, well, it would make me feel better, yeah. Also, Jesus Christ, I did not know customizing guns was so goddamn expensive. Uh-huh. Did you ever, like, ask him how much your guns cost? Your custom yeah. the, the... I did. I told him to do an estimate for me, but he never did. And that's okay. I don't want to... I don't want to remind him and stress him out. I... I will. I was supposed to get them insured, actually. But purple coat's not around anymore, so... That's a terrible business idea. You'd never be, never be able to cover that. Well, I don't know about that so many, because... So many guns get stolen. Well, I don't know about that because uh, Coop, he was paid out like multiple times for Coop getting robbed. I would do like, is it, do they pay full price? Or do they give like a half or something? Uh, No, I think it's full or it's like up to a certain value for your shop or something like that. That's interesting. Yeah. <gasps> would you like to see it? Well, the gun that I just sure. got done. Okay. Which like one, Miss Fancy so Pants? You got, you got so many. No, I don't. Oh. I really don't. Well, you've got three now. Three I've what, got zero. Guns? Yeah, you've got three customized. Well, yeah. I mean, I lost the, I lost the bolt action, which I feel really shitty about. Um, but also, is it? Oh. Isn't that lovely? Wow. What do you think? Mm. You like the navy, do you? I, well, I do, yeah. I don't mind it at all. We call it the hand cannon. <laughs> Very nice. Uh... Not bad. I mean, with your aim, it's probably the best thing. Oh, oh. shot Wait, the fire. Oh, oh, oh. oh, she's got really good aim and it takes a long time to reload. So. Oh, I thought it was the insult. <laughs> so you make all your shots count and you have to with that good. Thank you very much. Did you get a good look at it, Moose, or would you like a closer look? Oh, no, I see it very well. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know what I have? Hmm. That is yours. I have 11 shells. Oh, you thank gave you. me days ago. <gasps> Flood. Yeah. Moose has a care package for you oh. from me. Oh. Is that food? No, it's money for thank the you. gun. <laughs> Which makes it seem like I'm making Moose pay for it, but I'm really not. I came in here and I Fair had enough, the yeah, money, yeah. and then I was like, I feel uncomfortable holding this much money. And so then Moose offered to hold it for me. Moose took it, yeah. And I said, okay, thank you. That I'd really appreciate it. And he did. I hide in me the love short. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> I come to see Spork. How many cobbler TV have while I go on and take Ada to a train station? Uh, I don't know if she actually had one today. Oh, she, she told me she would. She would. She was going somewhere, uh, and then she'd be around near Emerald, I think. Da, she she'd come back. They go to bed. Da. Oh, okay, good. Okay, good. I'm glad. Yeah. Now someone has my my special fish stew recipe. So. I fish know. Soup. I told him to ask you because it's yeah, so good. Yeah, he's good. He's a good. good yeah. Mm-hmm. Thank it's you all about for this, it, by the it? way, Flood. Oh yeah, I'm glad you like it. I don't know what I'm gonna call it yet, but. Have you shown it off? I was. I did. I showed them. I to might a way wear to... a gun belt just so that I can I can have it with me all the time. You wear on the yeah, gun I'm belt. Yeah, I'm off card is here. Hmm? I didn't say nothing. Mm-hmm. I'm oh. off card is here. Uh, so. What is better, a repeating shotgun or a double barrel? Uh, double barrel has more punch to it. Uh, yeah. But they're both shotguns, right? Yeah. One has uh, four shots and one has two. Yep. I think I think I'd prefer the four shots, to be honest. I prefer it, and it scares people too, because they see you're a just like, And then I started blasting. Yeah. Well, 
I know here I have uh, worked it out with Pearly. Mm -hmm. That if I'm standing behind here, bye, bye. Mm -hmm. I can do more damage with a repeating shotgun than I can with a double barrel. See, also, that's what I'm I know exactly too. where to throw a tomahawk at that wall to scare the shit out of someone. Oh, Jesus, really? Can you do it? Yeah, I don't can have a tomahawk. Right now? I stand right here for practice. Uh, so, I come to take all bullet. Uh, wait a minute. Where, where, where are you throwing it? Uh, to the uh, top right of the door. Uh, you know what? I don't feel comfortable doing it with with moose there. I really don't. Yeah, no, the the moose, the moose target. That could be a sticky situation. Uh, well, let's just let's just pretend that moose is standing there, but he isn't actually. I come from all bullet. I standing in doorway. Okay, we're pretending that you're standing in the doorway. I can handle that. You might want to step away a bit further as you get through from there, Moose. Yeah, what okay. What are you throwing? I don't know. You want me to throw, like, right at the... Here, let me... Wait, what is she throwing on? Uh, you want it... Oh! Yeah, exactly. Jesus, fuck. That is terrifying. But I... I did not realize... It's a bit more punch gonna... you throw a knife. Ooh. No bullet yeah. stolen today. I don't know I if I could do that. Mm-hmm. Did you watch it? You know, Pearly put it All through the back window up and would have hit a local fella. <laughs> oh, fuck. I, if I did that, I'd be in so Hey, Crit, how's it going? Oh, yeah. I ain't gonna tell shit. <laughs> oh, fucking... Oh, wow. Yeah, see, wow, there, right there into the door? Go, Jesus, McGregor. that's scary. No, that is scary. Mm -hmm. Now, here's the problem. Be very careful when you pick that up out of the door, because it might swing and hit you and you might cut yourself. Where the hell did I get a fucking hatchet from? I the think hunters. that's mine I gave you. <laughs> Where the hell did I get this fucking hatchet? <laughs> okay. See here. You meet the lumberjack. Oh, what mm -hmm. the fuck? Holy shit. Did you hit both sides, didn't you? No. Yep. I don't think I could throw a knife. That's I would not be any good at that for sure. I try to throw Baba Yaga. Hmm? I try to throw Baba Yaga. Yeah, we, we, yeah, you, yeah, you try and throw. Sure. What's Baba Yaga? Oh wow, what that is fuck? Baba Yaga apparently. Very your machete. I feel like this is maybe we uh, should be aiming at this good. back wall where there yeah, is no. literally no one. Mm. That's actually more dangerous because people are not expecting you can't see anyone. <laughs> yeah. People walk through there through the thoroughfare, you just go through a window, hit someone in the back. Mm. <laughs> Asher, what's going that, on? That door. Hi, Chris. Someone's gonna open that guaranteed. Yeah. Yeah. Um Hey Sparks. Mm-hmm. Need to talk to you. Okay. Spork in trouble again. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. What Sparks I do? In trouble. What I do? I found in the prison cell. Adios. Oh. <laughs> Adios. <laughs> She's going willingly. Da. Ruby, get to the bed, okay? Yeah, she was having a baby rage. What did that mean? I mean, she was, she was crying like a child because she didn't get to sleep. Oh, I thought that means she wants a baby. And you have to go home help her. No, that, that, that's baby craze. Baby crazy. Oh. You're going to use that against me, aren't you? Baby. <laughs> <laughs> How did everything go with the riders? Fine. Okay. They make a I'll little thread at the end, but it's fine. No, okay. I sent Jody a tailing ring because he wanted me to whenever they showed up in town. Duh. And I didn't see it there. Duh. All right. What did they... They just doing their whole thing, you know, we're going to go get Jody, don't stand in our way sort of thing? They did not say that to me in particular, but they, uh... They want to know that we they don't have a problem with us. With Timmy and family. Yeah. But if Jody just happened to be with us, see what happened then. 
Yeah. Ah, shit. Well, we traded the dead Lobos in for Ty Ryder and his family. Duh. Fucking rather it was the dead Lobos. At least the dead Lobos can't shoot worth a damn. Duh. He shoot the very well at the Prague one. Yeah. But then again, the wheat stuck in the house. And then again, also, it wasn't only dead Lobos there at Pronghorn. Uh, did it. I got some news there you might want to tell your family, too. Uh? Uh, looks like the war is going to be ending soon. Both sides are losing it. And there's the man of the hour. Well, well, well. Speak of yeah. devil and shall I be a... appear. What, you, you about talking about me, son? Little bit. Yeah, you check your telegrams. I did, yeah. I, uh, that's why I came straight to source. Mm hmm. So, what's that all about? Uh, it came for a shopping trip today. Uh. They came in general store, uh, Sparks is in the changing room, and, uh, I said, well, Ty Ryder, it has been an age. And, uh, we got to conversating. You know, just, you know, a little, little particular as to how Asher, you things are great. How's, right how's everyone? Crazy-ass role-play session. Sort of thing. Add it. Can I help you, uh, family? Uh, I'm just uh, perusing for rifles. So just wonder what you have. Oh yeah, yeah. Got uh, got the Lancaster Repeater. Uh, specifically rifles or long arms in general. Uh, probably both. Well, I got the reliable double double barrel here. Got the repeating shotgun. The I got a link what buzz looks like to everyone. If you're looking for something a bit more basic, we have the repeater carbine as well, which I see you actually have on your back there, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. right, yeah. Uh, I yeah, also, how much a uh, one of them Lancasters run? Uh, 350 off the shelf. Unfortunately, I don't have any I've fixed up in yet. Whatever. Turkey All right. Turkey All right. What's your name? Uh, Flood. Good to meet you, friend. What's Flood, yours? pleasure, wide. Good to meet you, Wyatt. Well, I'll be damned. Oh, I haven't wow. seen you in a while there, mister. Oh, hey. Hey, it's been a while. You still, uh, hitting the gambling tables? No, oh, you know, as always, I, I thought you haven't got yourself killed or something. Well, come close, I guess. Uh, luckily, I still breathe. Uh, it sounds like, uh, Dean's Yeah, I guess that makes sense. laying too low, really. Yeah, hey, I feel that. Uh, y'all seen, yeah. uh, you seen Sparks? Look. Yeah, uh, McGregor had, was having a talk with her. Oh, great. All right, well, then I got plenty of time. Yeah, exactly. Also, I love uh, that poncho. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yeah, uh, why? I also have a, uh, right here for 650. Uh, if you're interested in All that. Right. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here comes Moose. Ah. <laughs> uh, Moose. Uh, are you all ready? Are you all ready? Yeah, nice lay down. What? I want to climb on top of table and jump over. Yeah, yeah. Try that. Well, please don't jump on the other table. Uh, oh. Oh. His face. Yeah, yeah well. Uh, that's this is nice. Uh, that's well, nice. Is, is your me. head on my <laughs> I honestly feel like I could go to sleep my right foot now. Is, is, is touching your breast. That's the knot of my leg. Oh, I don't... oh my god. <laughs> Did you not bury your mouth and Tanner's neck right now? Uh, it feels... uh, well, my face is on his chest, not on yeah. his neck. That's Thank right. you very much. I'm so sorry. 
Oh my god. Your heart's going pretty fast, though. Well, <laughs> yeah. I freak him out. <laughs> uh, yup. <laughs> yup. What would they call this? Like a cuddle puddle or something? Yeah, something like. I think this is going to be a prank. If anyone walks over, they're going to be all being shot. <laughs> Pronghorn too. The gazebo. Pronghorn too. Oh, <laughs> the gazebo. Christ. The gazebo. The Holy gazebo fuck, that's massacre. Dark sparks. Sorry, I'm sorry. It, it really is. Listen, I cope with humor. I do too. Oh, Christ. Oh, well, good night. <laughs> yeah. I'm fucking. I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> oh, okay. oh. Damn it. Leave it to Sparks to ruin a special moment. Oh, sorry. Okay. Fine. Oh, Ow. my fucking all. Oh, my um, God. Whose well, horse is that? That would have been horrible. Horse. Is that your horse? Is that horse, your horse, horse get in on cuddle puddle? Oh, oh, not to think so. Absolutely horrific. Then it that really would be pronghorn number two. Oh, it was a bloody. My mistake. I get the bloody out of here. Bad boy. No, no, no. no. You're gonna break that. You know that, right? What? No. What? First of all, wait, you McGregor, are you going to bed? You were talking about how you didn't, you didn't, you don't normally go to bed at normal people times. I don't know. I usually do not. Mm -hmm. I also have to <laughs> finish up that of paperwork. Okay. Sparks I could probably uh, just write, just write from months. your heart, Zach. But right from your heart. If you too. say I'm gonna get my head down, or you know, set any kind of anything then that is going to bring down 400 the lobos are going to raid through yeah. town mm. yeah. you see it. so i'm going to get my head uh, down what are you doing you mad oh my <laughs> god here they call <laughs> if that had happened i would have laid in the road i would have just <laughs> given myself up to them at that point yeah, my heart take up off the ground. Ground. With my fucking <laughs> hands up jesus christ oh. holy shit <laughs> that was Oh boy. Oh. See, nothing happened though. We're okay. Uh, it, For now. Where's Mr. Mm -hmm. Flood? He's still around. Are they gone? Oh, Flood and Jody might still be in the gun store. Flood yeah. and Jody? Duh. Is Jody still? Duh. Oh, huh. holy shit. Did I need to speak to Jody before we leave? Okay. Okay. I'm going to do my paperwork fast then. All right. All right. Right here. I'm not Enjoy even Enjoy that. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Juicy paperwork. Mm -hmm. uh. Oh, doggy, come up too. <laughs> yep. Come, puppy. Mr. Quinn. Oh. That, that's a Mr. Quinn. Damn. <laughs> he in I lot of he, trouble. He, he doesn't like it when I do that. I'm sorry, Jelly. I said I wasn't going to do it again. So rude. I'm just gonna ignore you. Give you a cold <gasps> shoulder. Don't. <laughs> yeah. Please don't ignore me. I, 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 I'm just gonna pretend you're not real. Can't Aww. see you sometimes. Like, oh, yeah. did somebody hear something? Oh, that drives me to the me to the water barrel. Yeah. Okay. Let's go to the powder room. Well, now this is just awkward. Yeah. Now you with... can't ignore me. Well, I mean, I could. Moose, how are you today? You're not Good here. Too. Someone asking questions. Oh, what? that was that was embarrassing. Don't even try a second time. Oh, come on. Mm -hmm. Are you going to still ignore me? Well, it's kind of impossible now. Oh, man <laughs> running over to McGregor. Man from Porto running over to McGregor. Yeah. Please don't. That'd be something. What if I got you? Two cans of assault. That'd be something. I, you know? Mm-hmm. Would that be two counts? Mm-hmm. That's two now. Assault well, and pepper. Yep. Exactly. <laughs> Well, I could, I could uh, report you. For what now? For assaulting my senses. I don't think that's a. I don't think that's how it works. <laughs> oh, oh that, I don't think that's it. It's him with the smell. Mhm. Mm oh. And also, he's been very mean to me in the past. That's not true, mm -hmm. actually. Mhm. Mm I, I mean, would, I've been mean to you too. You can admit it. It's I would. Fine. I would. I would say you've been <laughs> probably meaner if we was gonna weigh him out. I think mm, I. I think I was justified. That's debatable, but uh, you know, don't need to. 
I'm just kidding. Joking. Don't need don't need opening wounds. Uh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, Moose, uh, Flood tells me you had a uh, a talk with our old friend. Or was or was that a is that a new talk? First talk with me. Uh, other talk with a uh, Oh yeah, too. Nah. Not 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 a both in the road. Road with me, they find the TV uh, by window rock. Alright. Uh, anything I should uh no? Not I think so. They uh, uh, they I can forgive. step away if y'all need to talk. I don't really matter that much. They forgive TV and family for what we do. <laughs> Makes no fucking sense, but all right. You know when you know when animal in cage it get in corner and start to scratch a scratch if someone come near. Mm. They remind me of that. Yeah, all right. They make little threat at the end. Oh yeah, what they say. That if we go after them, that they hurt everyone around us. Ah, so what? <laughs> oh, that's rich. Uh, Man, got some balls like him that. <clears throat> a mini bullet in him, too. Oh, he's getting quite pricey. Almost at a quarter box now. Be a shame it had to be a half. I'm sure it's fine though. Got some balls running through ropes though, I'll tell you that right now. Uh, uh, was not expecting to see them here. Yeah, I don't know why they is. They all did Are, talk to me. Yeah, maybe. <sighs> this town gets worse and worse by the day. Tell you that. Yeah. Well, if it makes you feel any better, better uh, Morgan got a hatchet thrown at him. I heard that. Yeah, that did make mm -hmm. me feel loads better, actually. Yeah, I but then I treated him. You should have uh, put some poison right in the wound. Well, I didn't know it was him. That fellow is the most insignificant, boring motherfucker I've ever met in my entire life. Mm. He also thinks he's somebody. But... Well, he's yeah. with Annabelle, right? Yeah. Yeah. Not many, not too many things really rub me the wrong way, but I fucking hate tough guys. Hate them. Hmm. What? <laughs> Why you hit yourself, Jody? <laughs> Thank you, Moose. <laughs> we own, we have the same amount. Oh, there he go. Oh. We hurt him. We have to go hug. He not in the cuddle puddle before. We go get oh. him, put him in cuddle puddle. Do you want me to do that? I'll rope <clears> him up. <throat> ah, we put him at center of cuddle puddle. Ooh. How's it going? No, I, I didn't get an enthusiastic round today. That's that's upset. Well, I heard. Okay, I will. Mm -hmm. I will. No, you don't add. Repeat. I'm just fun. Mhm. Mm Moose wanted to put you in a cuddle puddle, Jody. Yeah, well. To say I didn't, sorry. I didn't appreciate his last comment. I do not believe that I'm a tough guy. Thank you very much. I have you, feelings just as everyone else does. You're just made of tougher stuff. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I forgive you, Moose. I don't forgive Amber. <gasps> mm-hmm. See what I did there? Where Amber? She's not here. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. Uh -oh, going on. That was good. Yeah, we was talking earlier. I was just gonna ignore him because she always says, uh, "Mr. Quinn drives me out of my fucking mind." Okay, I go get her now. Or yeah, cuddle paddle. Oh, just run me over. No, good. He stopped when I get here. Just end it all. You folks okay? Very fine. My nah. pride and emotions are not. But physically, yes. You guys need a hand up? No, I'm okay. Is that you, Rick? Oh, is that Miss Amber? How are you doing? <laughs> no, the invisible woman here. Oh, Mr. Oh. Carl, what are you doing running around? Uh. Oh, is that Moose? 
Da ist der Muss. Hoi, 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 Yep, yep, got beaten up, got a hole in my ass. It's great, it's fantastic. Did you get, get your ass looked at? Yep, it's all stitched, but that means I can't ride my damn horse or run around too much. Um, oh. Right. oh. We're doing this again? Yeah. Oh. Jody, yeah. made, Jody they are, was mean to me, so I had to walk it off. They're private part in my face. Oh, this Blood. is... Uh, Sorry, Moose. Sorry, Moose, I, went, I meant to go for the ass. <laughs> Everyone oh. does... I get up. Yeah, I had uh, oh, a boy, Moose. Uh, uh, where did Jody go? Who is He's that inside the store, being me. Oh, hey, okay. you folks know where I can find some oregano? Oh, right about right. Daily Grab, Mr. Sean. Uh, yeah. I got that one. Yeah, I'm looking. I'm after a bit more. Uh, I don't oh, you, you want a shitload? I know where some is. You got trade yeah, for it, it, though. Uh, nah, I need some local. I need it, need it, need it. Like I want to put a quick little barbecue together in Valentine, see? Uh, well, this one's near Valentine, actually. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Where, where, where? Okay, you know the Dakota River? Just north of there? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. At the foot of it, where you can cross? Go down there, there is at least six or oh, eight uh, plants of oregano. Alright. You talking you about mean? near uh, McFarland, before McFarland? No, no. Oh, it's there are a lot of Dakota, Oregano North there. Of Valentine. Uh, oh. By foot, you mean near that island? Sort of? Or uh, further up? Like, if, sorry, if I'm looking at... Mean. If I'm looking at where it says Dakota yeah. River, oh. where, where do I go from that? Oh. Okay, so right, you see so the, the first. that has, like, a little water <laughs> no. They're out back. Uh. McGregor is in his own world? In the report the town. Mm -hmm. Either that or he ignored me when I was making fun of him. Ignore who? Mm. Oh, you're right no. there, Miss Amber. No. Oh, and if you if you search up and down the river, you'll find a bunch of herbs and eggs too. You can use. Oh, fantastic, fantastic! Thanks, I appreciate it, mate. What's your name? Ah, uh, Flood. Good to meet you. Even though when I oh, play Mr. game, Flood, I always I see you. Huh? I am one of the gunsmiths there. Okay. I'm not the owner, but one of the smiths. Uh, all right. Um, I was referred to by uh, Mr. Rockwell. No, yeah, yeah, Peter. Yeah, yeah. He um, see, I'm a, uh, I'm putting together a little. I don't know if you've been around Valentine, but I'm putting together a little safari company, Roxton Safari. Okay. Safari. And uh, I've quite a bit of experience with elephant guns, but I understand that there's none in uh, stock at the gun shops. I was uh, wondering if you knew where to find some. Uh, I am looking to acquire some. You so want to check the again? I will let you know. All yeah, right, we can do that. I'm assuming but. you ain't got no uh, maps where they're located. I do have some maps. I just don't want to interrupt them behind the store because they're all talking. Uh. Probably talk about the radar coming to town. Radar Jody number one in on me. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. You feeling okay after that talk you had with him? Yeah. Okay. Tar was keeping an eye on you the whole time. He told me. I appreciate. Mm hmm I was watching too, but... Like you. I don't know how much I could really do for you. Although I'm getting pretty nasty when it comes to shooting game. Have to take you to where bears are. Ooh, I don't know if I can keep my cool for bears. I uh, try. We scoot you up onto rock, then you'll be fine. You have mm. a bolt action? Yeah, I do. Ah. Uh, if not, I could have borrowed mine. 
Let's get you up on the rock. Big rock mm. that bear cannot climb. That sounds good to me. It will shoot right up between the eye. Mm. Uh, hey, Hacha. How are you? shots from a bolt action doesn't normally take if you get him right between the eyes. One. Really? Uh, oh. Sometimes can even shoot in jaw from a while away. Hmm. And it will look at you, will roar, and then start to walk away slow because message from a shot not to reach a brain in time. <laughs> and it fall over dead. Mm. Ah. Brutal. Put a $40 pelt. Oh, wow. Plus get a piece of meat to make a sausage. Oh, Cubasa. that's fair. Ah. You ever hunt a moose? How hunt a self? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Although I heard someone saying there is a moose uh, around O'Cray's. It has a family there, probably. Ah, I've seen. Hmm. You protect your brethren, huh? Protect and not to shoot a two different thing. If people <laughs> want to shoot a moose, animal moose, not a me moose. They can. Well, I won't be shooting any moose, don't worry. <laughs> Yet. What? Oh. One second. Uh, you think Sorry because you walk in uh, so many circle? Maybe. Maybe I'm just like helping things digest a little bit so it comes out. What you been eating? You need to go around in circle to help a push out. A... <laughs> no. All right, you want to go interrupt them? Duh. All right, let's do it. You first, though, so it looks like you're the one who's not courteous. <laughs> if I go first, they not see who behind me. Ooh, I'll hide.